What's up? We got what's up. Welcome to Back in Reviews, where we were we welcome back in reviews, where we review old stuff and old old new stuff and old stuff <laughs> new stuff that I haven't seen before and old stuff that I haven't seen before. And today we we will be reviewing the Powerpuff Girl season one episode one, Monkey See Doggy Do and Mommy Fierce. Yeah, episode one and episode two. So yeah. We are, you're probably saying back reviews. Again, you already did this movie like a year ago, but yeah. That's when I went, again, like with Dawson's Creek, that's where I just stopped reviewing the show. But as you know, Dawson's Creek, I just want to go back and review the show. So, anyway, we see in the city of Townsville, where everyone is asleep. And we cut to the shot in the narrator, voiced by Tom Kenny. Tom Kenny's great in this role. He also voiced the mayor. So, he says that everyone's asleep, including the Powerpuff Girl. And Buttercup is dreaming about fighting a monster. And he's like, you go, Buttercup. But then he cuts to the museum where he's like, oh no, someone's not asleep. <clears throat> so then the next day, it's revealed that someone stole the Enuma's dog head. And, Power and the Powerpuff Girls are like, are like, hey, who did this? But then they're like, uh, yeah, we have no idea who did this. We have no idea who did this. So, yeah. But then, it's re but then we see a green monkey reveal he that he's Mojo Jojo. If you haven't watched my review for the original Power of Girls movie, then you should really check it out. I went a year ago. I know my voice was, my setup was way different back a year ago than it is now. But please, check out the Power of Girls movie. If I, if I can check out the Power of Girls, you can check out the Power of Girls. So, yeah. And then there's like, Mojo Jojo. Saying so so, hope the Power of Girls are on the, on his trail. Oh yeah, so yeah, the Power of Girls are not on his trail. Not one bit on that guy's trail. So yeah, so yeah, so Mojo starts using the newest dog head to turn everyone into dogs. Including the narrator. No, not the narrator. He's the best character, and he's voiced by Tom Kenny. So, yeah. So the power of girls go to, go to the get a call from the mayor, who's now a dog, and he's going to say Mojo's name, but he fully reverts into a dog, and Miss Bellum is a dog, and we actually see her dog face. That should not be possible because we don't see Miss Bellum's actually real face. That should be impossible, man. Impossible. 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 It's impossible. So, yeah. So they see everyone turn into dogs. And Mojo, Mojo hypnotizes all the dogs, people they turn into dogs, to do his bidding. And just steal. So the powerful girls would go back to their house where they were to feel, oh no, the professor got turned into a dog. And now he says, bow bow, bow bow, bow bow, bow bow, bow bow. And they try to play fetch with them as Mojo, as, as dogs are, are, are thieving dogs and they steal stuff from Mojo Jojo until he's like, until he's like, bow bow bow. And they're like, Mojo Jojo's behind this? And he's like, bow. So they're like, so they're like, let's go stop him. But as soon as they go, go stop him, he's like, uh, yeah, you guys can't stop me. Here, you guys turn into dogs. And now we got the Power Puff Dogs. Or the Dog Puffs? The Power Dogs? The Power Dog Puffs? Yeah, they're dogs and they can't do anything. So Mojo sticks his evil dogs on them and they basically get into a fight. Get, get into a fight with the dogs and are able to win. So, so, so Mojo is like, ah, you will not get me in. You will not get me in my, my special dorm. 
But then they're like, but then Buttercup's like, um, Butter Dog is like, uh, I'll get you and and bites him, ca causing the Nubis to break, releasing everyone under his control. But kind of funny that everyone who releases their dog under releases under dog control is turned into a human with human turning back to their regular clothes. But the but the Japanese guy who had cl his clothes on when he, before he was turned into a dog reverts to a human and he's completely naked. That doesn't make no sense. Anyway, that doesn't make no sense. Anyway, what happens is, is that the is that the Anubis dog head breaks on Mojo and he turns into a dog. So the per so but I was like, can we keep him? We never see him. Like, it's never understand how Mojo returns back to being a human. We, so yeah. Returns back to being a green ape again. But it's, it's too far to be explained. So, yeah, so the, the Powerpuff Girls are like, they, can they keep him? But then Professor's like, Hey girl, there is a lot of responsibility to keeping an evil supervillain dog as your pet. You gotta do a bunch of stuff. And they're like, yeah, we will. As, as my, and then we see the hard thing where the narrator is rough, rough, rough. And he says, trick ya. And this is another, t once again, the day is saved. Thanks to the Powerpuff Girl. So then, in the second episode, Mommy Fearest we see the power of growth and they're watching the but the professor decides to take them to bed until he decides to slump into a unhealthy depression because guess what just because the power just because the just because the professor loves the power of girl doesn't mean that he doesn't want someone else to be in his life and that's why he's that's why he's not showing around his daughter that he wants a woman. He wants a mom figure in their life, in his life, so he can sleep next to in bed to raise his daughter. So anyway, at the at the grocery store, we see we see Professor just just, just hanging out when he meets Good Lady, first name Ima. Yes, her name is I'm a Good Lady. Or, as I'm going to refer to her, she's a good lady. Ima. So I'm going to keep calling her Ima because it's... So, so... The girls are fighting, but Bubbles keeps saying, She loves Friday at 7 o'clock. So they're like, okay, Friday at 7. <clears throat> and Professor is being the simpiest simp I've ever simped. And continues to... So... He puts the mayor in charge of watching the Powerpuff Girls because he couldn't get anyone else. He gets the mayor. So the mayor falls asleep and uh, they come back and he's like, Hey girl, I have a surprise for you. I'm moving in. Okay, Professor. Again, he's the simpiest simp I've ever simped. Why is he letting this woman that he's met for only one date move in with him? Like... Wouldn't it take a while for that to happen? Move in your relationship? But now Professor's like, okay, I'll go and save one girl. Uh, an hour later, hey, she's moving in. Professor. Just. Just Professor. What is wrong with you, man? Why are you letting this girl into your house after one day. Why? So anyway, she says that she wants to talk to the Papa girls on the cell. And that's when she turns all mean, being like, being like, huh? And she's like, who are you guys? And she's like, and she's like, we're the Powerpuff Girl. And then she turns on me and saying, Ha, huh, and that's the attitude that's gonna change around here. And she's like, and then the narrator is like, There's something I'll miss, or should I say, a missus. 
Good one. Good one, narrator. <laughs> so anyway, yeah. So the powerful girls decided to go out. But then I'm is like, then I'm a bad lady. He's like, because she's a good lady. He's like, uh, she's a bad lady. He's like, hey, you guys are not going to, you guys aren't going to do anything. But you guys are going to do it. But with, so, so they clean it up, but then she starts wrecking the place saying, You guys are gonna do it without your superpowers. She's the worst. So they basically start to clean up. Boys, I'm the worst. So, yeah. So she basically starts to be a strict mom, and, and so. Uh, yeah. So they said this. So she said to say, "Oh, they're like, hey, professor, let's watch the new show." But then I was like, "Oh, you're not doing that. You're going to bed early because young girls have to wake up nice." And then he's like, uh, "If I says go to bed, you have to go to bed because professor, you're just let's." You're letting yourself be bossed around by a girl you only knew for like a day. So yeah, so then she's like, so then she rips Octi away from Bubbles. You're the worst. How dare you? And then yeah, but then a one, but then one night she snee. So yeah, a one. So yeah, so so a one night the Powerpuff Girls decide to say. Oh crap that I'm a and 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 blah and blah and blast herself and and fight crime. But then I'm as like I'm as but then I'm as waiting for them. I'm as I'm as waiting for them and it's like where have you guys been? She's like with well, a pap of girls, duh I love bubbles and I love bubbles. Baba, bubbles. I love bubbles. Bubbles is the best character. So yeah, so the professor, so she decides to go all sulking to the professor about that the power of girls were meaner and about, uh, uh, about, uh, about, and uh, how the professor uh, how they're mean to her and about how they didn't listen to her cure few. So, and they snuck out and fight crime. So Professor like, oh, yeah, I totally believe this random woman I met, met for a day. Girls, go to your room. You're grounded. What's the matter with you, Professor? So, so anyway, what happens is, is that the mayor decides to, so Ima decides to skip out of the, out of the house one night while the girls are grounded. And the mayor says, call them about Sedusa, break about Se about Sedusa stealing all her jewel about stealing all his jewel. So then they're like, um, yeah, we'll wait for Sedusa to get home. So then, so then so they sedu so then they come, so then, so then they decide to confront Ima, and she's like. I thought I grounded you. And she's like, and she's like, um, you won't be grounding anything anymore, Ima. And she's like, where's the professor? Yeah, weird. And she's like, she's like, you're not going anything anymore, Ima. Or should I say, Sedusa? And then the thing's like, Sedusa? Who would have, who would have thought? Yeah, who would name your character? Who, why would you name your character Sedusa? Obviously, she wants to seduce. So, yeah, so they realize she is the... But Professor comes home and... And she just gives a sob story about... But then she's like, it's a, just seducing the, the, the sky. But then, but then we... But then, but then she tries to get Professor to take his hand, which she does. But then it's only to arrest her. And he's like, hey, we're kicking this seducer out of our house. So then it's finally nice, normal in the Powerpuff residence until this random girl comes in 
and and Professor again falls in love. And the narrator is like, "Hey, girl, I think you need to nip this in the bud." And that and now that day, once again the day is saved thanks to the Powerpuff Girl. So, what do I think about these first two episodes? Okay, the first episode was kind of not all that great. Like, I liked it, but I felt the second episode with Sedusa was a better introduction. Like, we got to see the girls fight crime. Not fight crime. We got to see their home life. We got to see what the professor is like. We got to see, like, he's just this guy who wishes he had love of a girlfriend so he could share his girls with. And and the girl are very worried about Professor, obviously. I think it's ridiculous that he allowed Iman or Seduce to stay with him after one night of knowing her. That was and how he would immediately keep choosing her side over the girls. Like, come on dude, you barely know this woman and you're choosing her side. I like the ending that he chooses his girls over Sedusa because he knew she was evil, but and then the girl, and then he, he, again he falls in love because the professor is a smooth operator. He's a smooth operator. But anyway, that's it for this video, and I'll see you next time for the next episode of Powerpuff Girl 1998. But blossom. Once again, the day is saved thanks to not simping and also thanks to Beckham's review. Once again, the day is saved thanks to Beckham's reviews. Bow, 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 bow,